The fast food franchise Freshie, noted for its salads and healthy foods, has been a focal point of Chicago organizing for workers' rights. We'll learn about those unionization efforts in this segment. I'm here today because I was fired for concerted activity. My boss was stealing our wages and I had access to our system. So I went into our time punches and examined when we were clocking in, when we were clocking out. And it turns out that we were being robbed about $100 per person per paycheck on average. I put together a spreadsheet showing what we were clocking in and out as, the total time, what we were actually being paid for, um, help kind of, um, I guess we, we gathered as a group so I could kind of show everybody like what it was they made and then what it was that they didn't actually make. Um, we decided as a group to march on the boss and present a demand letter demanding our recognition as a union, our unpaid wages, and a change to his wage theft policies. And to that we got part of the money that I requested. Um, there are still some people who haven't received their back wages. And then once he realized it was me that accessed the system and made all of this possible, I was promptly terminated. It all started when we found out that uh, our time, our, uh, I'm sorry, our paychecks have been coming up a little bit light. We were able to obtain our time card information, even though Peter didn't want to hand, our boss Peter didn't want to hand it out over to us. We found that uh, workers were owed almost $2,000 in stolen wages. We had an initial march on the boss. We demanded the payment of the stolen wages and the recognition of the union. Um, we recovered the majority of the wages, so some of the wages have still not been paid in full to workers. Uh, since then, he's ignored our calls to recognize the union, to sit down and meet with us. And uh, two workers have been fired. One worker was fired immediately uh, after the action. We did a phone zap for him, and at that time, yet another worker was fired. Throughout here, it's worth the rehiring of those workers, as well as other workers who have uh, faced um, um, action against them because of their support. I personally took a week off sick. It was authorized, and when I came back, I've been cut to only eight hours. Definitely, I feel like this is a result of my open support in the union. We have another worker who uh, found out about this picket, showed his you know, excitement in the morning um, on Friday, and then he got fired before the day was over. So we've got a brand new slew of people in there trying to bust the unions. We're out here to demand the rehire of those workers and to show support for recognition of the union, as well as to recover the last of the stolen wages. At the end of my shift, which was approximately 3 o'clock in the afternoon, uh, corporate came in with Peter. They gave me my check for my wages that were owed to me that I had been shorted, along with a letter stating that I was being terminated for illegally accessing the system um, and releasing information to third parties. And in this, they were completely incorrect because A, I had the accessibility to the system. I did not hack their system to get the information that I had. And B, I did not release it to third parties. I released it to the employees.